Alright guys, welcome back to a new episode. I just want to give you a quick update before we um, start building here today. I have demolished the wall, um, well parts of it anyway. So I am going to remove that too and probably extend that fence a bit, but uh, I'm not sure what to do in this space. Uh, I might actually extend the, f the fence the other way around so it kind of links up over there, you know, over there. Uh, so yeah, extended the roads again. Um, I built an outdoor area for the the bathhouse because you know the sun goes over there. They can sit, and just relax in the sun, watch the people run around. But for today's project, uh, we are going to build a pub because you know we we really need to motivate these guys to actually you know have some sex and you know uh, reproduce so uh, we are building a pub t for them and that should get their you know <laughs> mojo going um, what I want to do with this thing is I want to build a two-story pub and you, you can see that the, the bottom one is going to be like a half cellar and then I'm going to make a road back over here, probably a bit offset from that one, that kind of links up, and you'll have like another entrance on the top floor. Um, so that should be kind of cool. Uh, I might actually make some rooms upstairs, uh, so you have like a bar downstairs, and then, well, if they fill up to it, they can just, you know, go upstairs and make some babies. Um, I haven't decided if it should advertise like an hourly uh, rent or, so or something. Uh, I think the old town area might be a bit too wholesome for that, so we'll probably save the more sleazy motels <laughs> for the downtown area, which is going to be over there, I guess. Um, because this is too hilly and this is too wet and jungly to really expand the town, and I think this should be basically in the out outskirts of the town and then the town will kind of naturally evolve that way. So we started the industrial district ba uh, back there and I'm going to level this down a bit before I build a road. Uh, might do something with this pond there though. Um, we'll see. And um, yeah. So I settled on using like a cobble layer in the bottom here because that it kind of it kind of looks like a old basements. Yeah, I'm out of cobble again. I'll have to go get some more. But, um... Well, the intention is that we'll have, like, a spacious cellar, but it's going to be dark, so I used, um... used, uh, just used, um... half slabs down here. That also gives you the windows in the proper height. And you'll have the door kind of set up a bit. So, um... <coughs> I was considering, actually, lowering it into the, the ground but since it's already a basement that's going to connect up I think it should be let's take this down again I might do another floor actually I might do a wooden floor we'll see now I'll I'll do cobble because it, it'll fit better but um just want to fill this in so what I'm thinking is probably having like a bar over here then some uh, stairs going up here in this corner and having like a lot of tables and stuff like that and hopefully we'll get some villagers just hanging out in here um, I'm also thinking having about having some residential stuff up on this hill here probably making some bigger houses more like luxury houses because well that's usually how it is right you know a bit outside of the town center you'll have like a big hill with some luxury apartments and stuff probably make like a mansion on top there that I will use as the storage room but uh, I'm kinda getting ahead of myself here and I just noticed that I did not put the sound back on <laughs> oh typical well it doesn't matter too much nothing that interesting uh, happening in the sound department but I'm just building anyway so um, yeah, the sound was off because I w I was actually oh, just clearing out some area here and 
over here and grinding a lot of gravel because this takes time and I was watching Good's um, newest episode um, where he is actually building a village so it was kinda interesting uh, so yeah I'll um, go get some more resources and we'll continue building right we're back <coughs> seems like we already have one thirsty patron and uh, that's a good sign, I guess. Oh man. So uh, you can, you might uh, see that I'm using an iron pick right now, and that's because, well, my diamond pick is almost gone, and I don't want to use it more than necessary because, well, with efficiency one, it it doesn't matter that much in terms of speed. So, um, I don't really feel like using it too much. You can see that it's it probably got a couple of hundred uses, but then again, mining like three stacks of cobble and it's gone. And I don't want to use it just for you know, getting some cobble. So, let's see. We shouldn't need any lighting downstairs now. Uh, so it should be all natural lighting. It should be pretty dark down there. And that's what we're going for. Yeah. This looks like a really dark, you know, dank pit. And, um... See, I don't know if the door actually changes that. If it gets darker. But I think the doors let some light through. But, uh... See what happens. Yeah, it didn't change anything. We'll do some glass here. Maybe even some iron bars because this is just a classic place, you know. Yeah, I'll, go, I'll get that later. Oh, lag, damn it. I have so much problems with lag lately. I might actually reinstall my computer at some point just because uh, I hate lag. So, this is going to be it bottom part and let's see I might do no I'll have the second entrance over here so uh, I'll be right back all right I made a cobblestone frame around here um, I'm thinking I'm going to um, probably have to add some soil here I actually have some so I could just make like a temporary walkway over to the um, to the door there just uh, let's just do this so the villagers can get up if, the, if they want to so um, let's see, yeah I did have some stairs and I like to kind of round out the stairs a bit so you can kind of hit them at the angle without any problems I'm going to keep it at this level I won't do that kind of sunk in thing on this side um, yeah, let's just uh, add a door here too, so we have it set and ready. I like having them this way because it kind of looks a bit better, I guess. So right, um, I'm thinking kind of inverting this. We will have like a wooden thing over here. I might actually put like kind of raw wood pillars here, but not yet I guess. So let's see. Um, we need some windows. We can probably just do it like this I guess. Yeah that's fine. <coughs> let's see. Yeah. Like this. This is going to be kind of the back entrance over to the more rich area not it looks decent it looks decent nothing that spectacular about it it's all right now what I want is I want to make like, um, I don't know kind of a I should probably make this out of wood I want like a balcony out there so you guys can yell sit and have a drink outside and j just kind of watch the people downtown and that also m helps make this area much much darker see, just uh, 
probably yeah, we'll just line it with the end here and we'll have this maybe a torch here and yeah I'll just go grab that uh, three tree over there it's good it was kind of a tall tree so we get some extra packs should be enough so I'll probably make like a small roof over this thing too out of cobble just to make it a bit more interesting and uh, yeah so we'll probably do the same thing over here then just to replicate the other thing and I'll make some bigger windows on the side so you can see see the town so like that and oh sloppy like that and probably have guess big windows over here like this this is three wide this is four wide let's do it like this I don't want to make the windows too high because you can't really see out of it anyway and you have to look at it from this perspective of both the player and the villagers this is actually quite a big window it's kind of open yeah and uh, we'll do some ouch supports here just this should oh well it doesn't really line up so we'll you can, you can probably do something cool with it, with the uh, upside down stairs though let's see this go like this this yeah that's good and this probably just fill that in and it looks kind of cool it's, it's different that's a uh, part of what I was going going for there just something bit outside the kind of r regular oh man <laughs> the regular kind of blocky feel it's kind of rounded it, it looks a bit different it might perhaps put some full blocks here just to kind of yeah I don't know I'll I don't know which of these I'll actually keep. Uh, you can probably come with a suggestion uh, on this one. <coughs> I'm thinking maybe getting some flowers down here, making it, making it look all pretty. Oh, you'll be the barkeep. So yeah, this is going to be really, really dark. Might just put some light in here. See if it's still kind of dark. No. Oh, it's way too bright. <coughs> I'll see if I can make something happen there maybe inset it in some glass or behind some water maybe so it's uh, it's um, damped a bit because this is, is a bit dark so um, let's see here probably do we need some bookshelves behind it we'll do it like this and we'll just remove so this oh right it's still gonna be good, I think we'll do let's just see if this is oh that's my phone. I'll be right back guys. <sighs> Alright, I just got a call from the guy who's going to take some pictures of my old house and uh oh, so much stuff I need to mess with. See, this is too tall, but if I put yeah, I think we can make this work. Let's see do like this for now just to then this and then the guy can stand over here and then the other guy stands kind of at the counter and looks up to the guy this is going to be cool um, so let's see just do this for now make it go out here so we'll have like um just do this and oh this Right. 
then we'll need to kind of get it in this way. But I'm not going to make it go. Let's see. I'll put some temporary light. This is uh, you, you guys were probably not able to see anything over there. Yeah. This. This. I'll just remove the tops here. And uh, let's see. Yeah. Something like this. Oh, I should have had a stair over there. Oh, let's see if we can make this work. Yeah. <coughs> and um, probably do like full blocks under here. So I'll just open this up a bit more and. Let's see. This probably just a full blocks the whole way over here, but I think it probably look best like this. Yeah, I think that's gonna look good. And then we'll do like a full block under here too, and we might just you know what? we'll do a full block here, and then we'll do um, like a trap door. So yeah. I'll go get some more wood and we'll continue on. Alright, got another stack of, of planks. So uh, we should be able to finish this. And uh, not sure how I want to do the lighting because because of the staircase going down here, there is going to be some lighting um, in this corner. So we might do like a small lighting thing behind the counter here. So it kind of lights the place up. Let's see, let's do this and. Uh, Oh yeah, this, this, and uh, this looks a bit derpy. And this too. I'm not entirely sure about this thing. You know, all this work for nothing. I'll just try doing this first, just to see if that kind of works, if that gives us the look we want. <coughs> you know what, that's fine, that's fine actually. Um, so... This... And um, did not put down. Uh, no, that's that was upstairs. I did not have a uh, crafting table here. So <laughs> it's cool. Let's just do this, and yeah, because that does not work in this kind of design. <sighs> I wanted to kind of replicate the trick I used to do, but then I probably need to. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Or something like this, yeah, because that would also kind of stop the lighting a bit. So do it like this, and we kind of get like still looks a bit derpy. Maybe it looks better. This it's made for giants, you know. Let's see if I just place some stuff here. And as I've said before, I'm not primarily like a builder, but um, yeah, I think that's okay, I guess. It's nothing really fancy, but uh, it works. And uh, I guess we'll just have like some lighting back here so that people can see the bartender. And I want some bookcases over here, so we'll just do. Probably do and, um, some wood at the bottom here. I don't want to put in the bookcases just yet because I need them for my enchanting table. But um, yeah, it's it's decent. Maybe if we do 
this. It look a bit better. Mm, yeah. Tell me what you think, guys. I'm not sure about this thing. But um, what I do know is that we need some tables and stuff. And uh, usually the easiest way to do that is to just um, a simple standard table. Uh, we'll probably not have any just in front of that, but have right because of the half slabs. We'll have to do kind of a heightened area for the like that, and maybe. Well, this is this is going to look really really weird, I guess, but uh, might look a bit different. That's uh, kind of what we're hoping to do. Yeah, it looks like kind of a booth down here. I'll uh, still move it this one back just so it'll fit a bit better. Let's see. We could probably move it straight over to the corner. I think that would look better. I, I actually wanted some kind of room around it just to make it a bit more get it away from the window and such, but uh you know what? Th this is this is fine. Yeah. <coughs> you know what? A lot of places actually have those kind of um tables that kinda stick out from the from the um, Oh man, my head is elsewhere. Uh, kind of stick out from the um, wall there, so that's fine. Let's just see how this will kind of work itself out. Is this? Well, you probably have to kind of get in between there anyway, so that that's fine. Just add some half slabs under here. I can still hit them, so that's fine. Um, yeah, let's just do this and. Yeah, I have to do kind of some tables over here too, but uh, I think we'll have to put in the stairs first. And um, man, again, my head is totally elsewhere, elsewhere right now. Uh, I don't care too much about running up the stairs, but what I want is I want some distance from the wall so you can kind of get. So you can turn around. So we'll probably start over here. This, yeah, it gets a lot lighter down here. That's uh, that's good. It's gonna get dark, especially in the in the. Um, hmm, this is going to be interesting. That's different. <laughs> if nothing else, it's different. That's uh, that's good. Guess we could probably some more wood under there. Uh, want this one more out, and yeah, I put those back there, my. Where did I put the iron fences? I want some iron bars. Or do I? Yeah, I want some iron bars there. Just because I don't want to do the wooden fences everywhere. And I like the, bit the fact that you can actually jump over those. Just take these because I might need them. Um, the more we need from this place. Put this back because I don't need it. Good. I'll just put um, the fences in their places right there, and then I'm. I'll have to actually run to the store, and when I get back, I'll get some more resources, and we'll try to finish up this build today. So um, just put this over here. Yeah, I like that. I do like that. Well, Probably just place this when I'm at it. 
while I'm at it. Look, we probably need to talk about my accent. Uh, it's um, you, you've probably understood by now that I'm not from um, an English-speaking country. I'm actually from Norway, of all places, and. Uh, what? The accent should be quite. Um, it might be irritating to you guys, but um, I, I'm I'm trying. All right, I'm I'm really trying. It's uh, when you only kind of speak the language when you are doing LPs and occasionally when talking to um, people from abroad, but uh, doesn't happen too much. I used to work with this Italian guy, but uh, <laughs> his English wasn't actually perfect either. So, uh, yeah. I don't even remember why I started talking about talking about this right now. But, uh, um, yeah. So, about the accent. I've seen people, for example, like Doc M. He, he's doing fine, even though he has quite, you know recognizable German accent so of course you know you don't see Norwegian accent in the movies so you don't have like a frame of reference but uh, if you were wondering that's that's uh, where my accent is from um, yeah I'll um, go head over to the store uh, and do that kind of stuff and I'll play some more in a couple of hours I'll get some materials and, and like four or five stacks of cobble and a couple stacks of woods so we can finish this place up and uh, yeah I'll see you guys a bit later and we're back and I've um, collected some more cobblestones we can finish this wall um, let's see yeah wasn't that much to it I guess but we need a proper roof on this one um, I'm thinking doing the whole um, stair thing, but I should probably like this. Put it, yeah, do one more layer and then because I do want to have something in the the attic too. So um, let's see here. This is almost dangerous. Oh. Um. Let's see like this. One up and yeah, I think I'm just gonna f finish up this roof and um, I'll let you see the finished product. Okay, so the main building is done. We still have some decoration to do, but we'll do that in another episode. I still think this looks a bit derpy, so I might do something down here. And uh, I think I might do something with the roof on the other side. This part looks alright. I might add. Yeah, I might just add some um, downstairs here just to kind of balance out the look. Of it. Yeah, that looks a lot better. So I'll do that. And. Uh, Let's see, and I'll probably add like something sticking out there with the window um, because that's over. Let's show it to you guys. Um, it's right over the. Um, oh man, so close. It's right over the staircase over here. So I might just lift this roof up a bit because it's a bit. Even though I did something here, it's still a bit, you know a bit uh, tight so I'll just add like an arch or something like that coming out there and then we have three private rooms here I'll add some um, I'll just do this so it looks a bit better uh, I'll add some doors here um, but I think the build is more or less done here this is a long episode but uh, I think we got something pretty decent out of it um, uh, we could probably just go out downstairs and see pick this up. I'll have to add. I'll add kind of a corner table or something like that over here, and add something more here just to make it a bit something a bit more here. And I'll try to trap a testificate inside here, so we have a bartender on 
permanent bartender in there. Let's see, can fill this in a bit. Yeah, I'll deal with that later. Yeah. So, but it's still it's open for business. Um, I won't really decide on what to do with this. I kind of lean on this side because it kind of matches up with the woods there. But uh, yeah, so let's see it from a distance. We could probably see it from up here. Now we'll do. We'll go to the tower and have a look at it. It's kind of laggy. I do have some input lag, so I need to do something with. Yeah, I think that looks pretty decent. Uh, might add kind of a stripe going over there somehow, just to m make it a bit better. And maybe a window there. Depends on what I do with road. I might actually pull that road up there and then around, so I don't uh, mess up the farm area too much. But yeah, I think this episode is done. Um, it's going to be a long one. I don't know, 45-50 minutes maybe. So. Uh, I <laughs> I hope you liked the effort and um, if you enjoyed this episode please like, please comment, please subscribe, please favorite this video and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next episode.